Okay, so um, basically I'm going to be talking about how we came up with the concept and everything on how we came up with the ideas for the mural that we did. So we all, we went on a few camp, camp, a few field trips so we could get some ideas and we went we went down, we went to the Duwamish River, we went to the Longhouse, we went to Camp Long, we went to all these places so we can get an idea of what we wanted to put on this wall and so and there were a lot of steps like we had to list down all of our ideas then we filtered through them and we got just the best of the best ideas to put onto the wall and it took about two I think weeks about two or three weeks before we even came out here and started painting and so that was basically the process we had to get a web and like get all the categories that we're gonna put and we split up the wall kind of into five categories and Marianne's gonna go into more detail about that and so yeah thank you Cedric Marianne's gonna read the first paragraph off the plaque that will live on this wall uh, once we get it up on the wall uh, uh, my name is Marianne and I'm by the this mural, this this mural, this this makes the story of Darius, from the natural environment and the native Guamish tribe to the international industrials of the city of the Guamish The tip of the river and the growth of Seattle, the diversity of the neighborhood and an honoring of the of the natural beauty and community that continues to surround us. The theme of the mural was determined by by community input and through research done by program participants and teachings and teaching artists of the Daryl 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 Great. Anything else you want to share about the process? Are you good? <laughs> 